my name is Bren. This is my girlfriend, Tina. Mwah. Mwah. This is our puppy, Zenny. Zenny. We've been living in our van now for about six months. From the day we got the van, it was go, go, go. We managed to completely build out the van and move in in about four months. It's taken a lot of effort, but we're super happy. You get to see this whole hippie trippy situation we got going on. This is our cab area, the driver's seat, obviously. If you look in from the outside, it looks pretty normal. We didn't want to stick out like a sore thumb. Yeah. We wanted it to be really stealthy so that on the outside, you can't tell what it is. But by the time you get into the back of the van, it's uh, it's uh, it's trippy. This curtain here for privacy. Woo. It also has insulation. Got covers for the sides as well. It's really easy to put away too. You just roll it up. Here is our kitchen custom countertop that I did with resin. Boom. We can pop it outside for a shower if we need to. Clean our hair, just like right in there. Or, or we could wash. <laughs> I actually put something in there. Oh, sorry, sorry. Hanging basket, fruits, vegetables, cans, you name it. We got it in the basket. Our handy dandy latte machine. Two storage space compartments. So we can fit lots of goodies in there. Here we have our garbage, our water tank, cleaning supplies, extension of the counter but it's a cutting board. Zen's food there. Food is airtight right in here. This battery bank here collects all of the solar power. We got solar panels on the roof and it plugs everything in it. Our fans, our TVs, my music equipment, everything. Whoa! This is my little studio. Got all my guitars up here. Got the microphone go in with the lights, my electric drum pad. I want to be able to set up anywhere on the streets, in someone's backyard, in someone's basement, in the bar. Like I could do it with this really small setup. So I can record all my music, laptop setup, and uh, we're rocking. We're both hippies. We're both plant-based nature lover people. So it meant a lot to us to be able to bring nature into the van. We've got all sorts of plants from the fern, aloe vera, palm tree, another big palm tree, snake plant, pothos, money tree, big ivy, some mint, parsley, basil, chives, rosemary, more parsley and basil, even more basil. <laughs> Obviously, you gotta have the skateboards. Our TV is awesome. We have our little cubbies. These couches are also storage, so we keep extra stuff, laundry, toilet. This is where we pee, and that's where we poop. Awesome. More storage, so stuff underneath this, where I keep my paint stuff. Lots of room for us to sleep and chill. We have our closet right behind. Same exact thing on his side. We're in couch mode right now. It's nice for having guests. A few people sitting on this, that side, a few people sitting on that side. Most of the time we stay in bed mode. We got a board, let's pull that out. Fits right between our two benches. These side cushions come over here. They fit right in the middle. Pillows go back there. We got our sheets and blankets and stuff in the bench. So we're not gonna set the whole bed, but it's comfy. It's bedtime. Yay. Oh, bedtime. So happy. It's my bedtime. <laughs> So yeah, we'd be laying here chilling, looking up at the skylight, enjoying our life. Come on. We can just open up to the most beautiful views. The views that we get to call home. We have each other, we got a place to sleep, place to eat, all the amenities, Netflix games, <laughs> music, art, yeah. at the same time as being at the beach being in the forest, being in the city, wherever we want to be. It isn't all glamorous all the time. You don't always have these beautiful spots. Sometimes you're in the city and your view is a dumpster. Yeah, we had to make sacrifices. It's not always perfect. It's perfect for us. The pros for us outweigh the cons. It's definitely not something for everybody. The van's constantly changing. In fact, it's already different than it was a week ago, two yeah. months ago. We'll probably do more van tours in the future, keep you guys updated on what we're doing. But if you really want to stay updated, you can follow us both on Instagram. You could subscribe to this YouTube channel where we upload vlogs. Keep up with us. Who knows where we'll be in the future? I mean, this is only the beginning. It's gonna be quite the journey, but stay tuned. Share this with a friend, someone who might be interested in living in a tiny home or a tiny space or in a van or trying an alternative lifestyle that most people aren't trying. Check out our last van video, the 10 van essentials that we have to have living in a van. If there are any other details that you wanna know, let us know in the comments, send us a message. We could answer your questions and maybe create another video yeah, filling in the sure. gaps for all the things that we may have forgotten. Thank you for watching. Subscribe, Love all that you. good stuff. Yep.